Hey, you're being really quiet today. No, I just really don't fucking like you. Hey guys, what is going on today? It's Jake, and in this video I'm going to be talking about how grief and turn fit into the Call of Duty Zombies storyline. <laughs> It is a little past uh, Black Ops 2 honeymoon phase and what all these questions bring up, but um, I've never seen this video covered or this topic covered on YouTube, so I'd just like to bring it to your attention. Even though it doesn't have any relevance to the Call of Duty Zombies storyline, like in terms of how the storyline plays out, it doesn't affect it at all. It just kind of fits in there, and it's, it, it basically Treyarch doesn't give us anything they don't tell us anything to do with the storyline we have to make it up ourselves and this is so this is just technically a theory but it is very accurate and you could per perceive it as fact anyways let's get started so turned we're gonna start off with is basically only playable on diner in transit or green run and the reason for that is because Rick Toffin he as the events of the Misty, Marlton, um, Russman, and Stulinger were doing the Easter egg for Rick Toffin on the map Green Run. He was bored, basically, to say. Rick Toffin was bored and uh, was. You, you could hear him saying, like, why won't you listen to me? Why won't you do what I say? So he gets bored. And that's basically what Turned is. He takes four CIA, or what is it, four CDC people. And he uses his uh, power that he's in charge of to resurrect people back to life um, after they're turning into zombies. And that's so it's basically like a game to Rick Toffin. He's just having fun. He's just uh, playing with them. He's not anything else to do with the storyline, but Rick Toffin's boredom, and this is just a game for him. The same thing goes for Grief. Also at Farm and Town, also in Buried, it's uh, Resolution. 2025 um four cdc and four cia were uh originally there at, in, at the africa site or at farm they were all over the world and during the events of buried uh rick Toffin also got bored got the four people to play against each other even though they do work for the same branch of government they do have different thoughts and uh, they wanted to survive so Rick Toffin put them on teams unable to make them hurt themselves with their actual weapons but having to fight against the zombies against each other so that's why you get butterflies when you knife them or shoot them or anything to try to damage them it won't work and that's because of Rick Toffin only wanting it to be a game for him to watch the same thing goes for Mob of the Dead now it's not the same person in charge it's the dark evil and people say that Mob of the Dead is in hell, but it really isn't. It's on the borderline of hell. It's basically, uh, if you were to say, like, a United States has borders, Mob of the Dead would be on that borderline to hell. So the person in charge of the zombies in Mob of the Dead, uh, you could say the devil or it, not the devil that you know, but a dark evil. Uh, in charge of the zombies. He also has the idea of making the four players play against each other and it's not the main characters it's actually prisoners or the people in the previous life that were in Mob of the Dead prison cells. They're prisoners fighting against each other against the zombies. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did make sure you guys leave a like. If you have a question make sure you guys leave it in the comment section below. If I didn't mention anything make sure to leave it in the comment section below too. Remember to like the video. If you haven't subscribed already please do. I post zombies content that you will not want to miss. Anyways guys I'll talk to you guys next time. Goodbye.